Let's see here. What do we have? Fried chicken. Pancakes and French toast. Little mix of seafood. Some desserts. Circus Circus sits at the north end of the strip just past Resorts World. Known to be a kid-friendly hotel with the Adventure Dome and Midway attractions, they also have a buffet. The Circus Buffet, as they call it, is open on Saturday and Sunday for brunch, and that'll run you $25.99 per person. And they're also open Friday, Saturday, and Sunday for dinner, and that will run you $27.99 per person. Definitely not a very big buffet, but it certainly does attract a big crowd. Today we'll take you on a walking tour of the weekend brunch and show you all the dishes that they offer. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Also, drop us a comment below and tell us what you think of the buffet. Alright, let's take a look at all the dishes. First up is the omelette station. You can have an omelette made your way. They have ham, bacon, sausage, onions, bell peppers, tomatoes, mushrooms, spinach, jalapenos, cheese, and you can get egg whites or egg beaters. The omelette actually tasted pretty good, but that's because it was freshly made. Here we have scrambled eggs, corned beef hash, bacon and sausage links, country fried steak, here's some biscuits, and country gravy. Go ahead and grab yourself some chips and ranchero sauce. Slap that on some chimichangas, why don't you? Here's spicy jalapenos, flour tortillas, Spanish rice, refried beans, chorizo and potatoes, some taco meat with a runaway potato in it, the taco shells, nothing more exciting than peach cobbler, or is there? Here's cheese blintzes, French toast, you guessed it, pancakes, Blueberry and strawberry syrup. You got your whipped cream and butter and maple syrup. My favorite part was still the made to order omelet. The bacon and sausage was okay too. Here you have bread, bagels, and waffles. Some additional condiments. Extra sauce, lemons and cheese. Here's spaghetti and meatballs. Baked chicken. Some baked fish. Beef stew. Clams and mussels. Even some crab legs in there. Kind of small though. Here's lo mein. Pork buns. Burritos. Chicken fajitas. Mixed vegetables. Au gratin potatoes. Fried chicken. Fried shrimp. Brown and turkey gravies. Mashed potatoes. The clams and mussels had a little spice to it, but it actually was pretty decent. The spaghetti sauce was a little runny, but the mashed potatoes were very buttery and delicious. Nothing classes things up like a ketchup and mustard station. Here's chicken noodle soup. And Tuscan sausage soup.
Don't forget to load up on bread and chips. At least that's what they want you to do. Here's some menudo. And look at that, some more menudo. Here you got some cilantro, onions, and limes. Straight into desserts, there's some mixed fresh fruit, some cottage cheese, looks like canned mixed fruit, strawberry yogurt, some oranges, yogurt, pineapples, granola, peaches, lemons, boiled eggs, and not sure why this is here, but butter. Here's a tray of brownies, some muffins, got some assorted cakes and pies. Can't get enough of that Nilla pudding. Some Previously frozen chocolate donuts. More pudding. Not gonna lie, the desserts were not my favorite here, but it'll do in a pinch. Here you have a cereal bar with some off-brand cereals. Some whole milk. Ice cream cones. And you guessed it, soft serve ice cream. They got vanilla and chocolate. Self serve beverage bar with soda juice, coffee, and iced tea. So, some final thoughts here. It's definitely not a high end buffet, it is a budget friendly buffet. If that's what you're looking for, this might be right for you. We hope you enjoyed taking a tour of the circus buffet with us. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Also, drop a comment below telling us what you thought of the buffet. Please check back on our channel because we have some more buffet tours coming up and some hotel reviews coming up.